There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Divas? It's your girl, April. So this is going to be a makeup haul from this new, inexpensive, cheap makeup company called Style 21. So I got a little small haul here for you guys. Nothing, like, really too fancy, but they do have makeup categories of one, two dollars, three dollars, I think. They got a bunch of stuff on their website, so if you're on a budget and you like makeup, then you have to check them out. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys in this box is this foundation that I picked up by NYX, and it's the Total Control. Now, it is a dry for foundation the color that I have here is called golden honey so this is a dropper foundation like I said and it's you're able to control how much you want to use so the color is a little bit off for me um, it's a little bit too reddish or not too reddish but a little bit too dark for my skin but once I do my highlight and contour it's not noticeable I just thought that I wanted to give this a try because hey something different okay but I will say this, I do like it as far as longevity wear of it. Well, it all depends on what type of skin you have. For me, I have oily skin, so not all foundation lasts all day for me. Um, for that one, I would say I got a nice amount of wear out of it, but I do have some that I would get like much longer wear out of. So moving on, I did get another foundation, which I think was like three or four bucks. This is Magic Collection. This is the Extra Coverage Liquid Type Foundation. So the color that I got in this one right here is Warm Caramel. And it does, every time I just keep twisting it off, but it has a pump bottle. Now as for this one, it's very, it's not too thick, but it's thicker than I like because I don't really like cake face foundation too much so to me it's very very thick and the color may seem a little bit too dark for me but for the price I think it was like two like three or four bucks I mean hey I like to have different foundations in my collection because you never know you can always mix it with another one especially when it's too dark like this I'll definitely mix it with something else that I'm running low on kind of like make my own little foundation so these do come in handy when you need backups as for full or extra coverage um, for me I don't really like a lot of coverage because I don't like to have cake face but I did try it out and um, I will say this it doesn't last that long especially if you have oily skin so but if you're on a budget or not even on a budget if you want to try something else out then give it a try because it's it's worth it for the price it's definitely worth it I think this is like a dollar which is by Beauty Treats the perfect cover concealer this one that I have here is in the color I don't know because I don't really know um, zero one so I'm gonna be honest and tell you this color was not really that this concealer is not really that great it's very kind of it's just kind of like sheer um, I ended up using my LA girls pro concealer because you know it's very sheer it, it just seems like it's something really cheap you know what I mean you'd have to keep packing it on and packing it on and by that time you got all this creasage and builds up underneath your eye so I would definitely pass on this right here which is by Beauty Treats not one of my favorite concealers at all this is called the perfect Co cover concealer not so not really so at all I'm not a big fan of that also, I did get this here by Beauty Treats, which was this um, eyeshadow palette, which is called Roses. So, my daughter, Nay, she is wearing makeup now. You know, she's only 15. She doesn't wear a lot of it. And you don't want to get her stuff that's really really expensive. So, I try to get her, like, neutral colors that are, like, really inexpensive makeup. And, you know, I've given her some of mine as well. But the colors are, like, so-so. Um, I'm going to say they're, they're not a color that you would find, like, with an Urban Decay. But for a starter or for just someone who likes to build their makeup collection then you can definitely check out beauty treats some of their things are really cool some of the beauty treats cosmetics are really cool but like I said they have all different types of makeup on it from a dollar to up and more they carry all different brands so that's the one thing that I like when you find a website that you can just you know venture out to and find different ones this, this is the HD gel liner I'm really not sure who this is by but it's in a dark brown and I'm gonna use this for my eyebrows so it's really a dark color but I did try it and I didn't try it meaning I sat in the house and I just did half of an eyebrow with it 
so far so good I'd have to go light handed with it because to me it's a very very dark brown and I don't like it so dark because my skin is really light and I don't want anyone to think they have uh, black brows on but for the most part it's a nice formula the consistency is really great I'm not really sure of the brand but I think it was like three bucks so if you're looking for like gel liners or pomades for your brows you can definitely check out um, style 21 no I do individual lashes so I did get this lash tight right here I love this stuff I always get this, this is by the Ardell brand so when I seen this on a website for super cheap a girl definitely had to put this in her cart um, this one right here is the clear one um, I only got this because you know I do have the black one by um, Ardell which works a lot better than this but it's always good to have a backup and sometimes switch it up like I'm saying if you're looking for a lash adhesive for individuals check out the Ardell line I love theirs especially the black one I think that one the black one lasts like weeks on me versus this one here but yeah it's just like a backup I did get for my daughter Janae a beauty blender sponge um, she loves the beauty blender sponges so I thought I would give this one a try for her um, I'm very particular about which one I use but she likes these ones a little bit more but they're really inexpensive I think this was a dollar one of my favorites I have been using these for okay so I had to throw it back in the box so that I was using these I was trying not to use them before the haul but listen you know when you're doing your eyebrows it's a really really hard sometimes so you definitely need like a really great q-tip so this one here is the mascara correction ones you can use this if you want to for your mascara but I like these ones sometimes I get these ones to have both pointy ends sometimes I get the ones that have one pointy end and the flat one but the pointy end ones are perfect hunties for sculpting and fixing up those brows so I love these these were a dollar I mean if you go to like Sally's you're spending three bucks you get six 65 of these. I mean, I can use like regular Q-tips, but these come out so much better. So I love these Q-tips, these cosmetic Q-tips, definitely for my eyebrows. I'm big on the face mask. So these are the face mask sheets, and these are also really, really affordable. I don't do them every day, but I do them like once or twice a week. Me and Mumsy, my daughter who's 10, we love to do the face mask together. She'll have one on, and I'll have one on. You know, it's just like this little ritual thing that we have together. I love these. Um, I seen this brand in um, Ulta. It was like two dollars some change for this. Girl, bye. Let me tell y'all something. I think like they all are the same thing. They just have different packages. I'm not spending like five dollars on a face mask or anything like that when I could just get them for a buck. Like a buck is way better um, than five. Like they all say serve the same purpose. Purpose. So this one that I have here is called I'm Real. Um, the Tony Moly I'm Real Aloe Mask Sheet Moisturizer, and this one is moisturizing, and this is the Radiance one, and this is the Tomato Mask Sheet. Never tried the tomato one. I've always tried the other ones never the tomato one so I'll probably give this a try this evening because I haven't used the one in days and then my face starts feeling kind of dry at night when I kind of like tone it so I'll probably just give this one a try just because I want to see the radiance that it brings out for me for my daughter um, nay because like I said she likes to wear makeup and stuff like that but I also like to give her stuff that she can carry around in her bag you know her book bag um so I do like to carry give her these things right here this is the body fantasy signature body spray kissing in the rain um, it does smell good it's just a small bottle like I said I like to get her things that she can carry around with her you know she has like deodorant in her bag she has a lint roller in her bag she has um, some I think she has gloss toothbrush Listerine chapstick and something else she had she has like a big bottle lotion and she has like this big bottle of body spray so I thought this would be cute just to put in her bag something small and dainty and it does really smell good you can also get these in bigger bottles but I like small stuff sometimes for certain things so that way you know you can just carry it in your purse put it in your car you never know you might be around somebody they might need a little spritz in you know you just like on them and you just keep it pushing so check that out on style 21 so the last but not least thing I wanted to give this a try because I ran out of style of setting spray for my face but I figured let me give this a try that stuff smells good um, and this is a brand I've never heard of before but never touch up matte finish um, uh, setting spray and I've never heard of this brand I can't remember the price on this but I'll, I'll just let you guys know how this works out but it's cute because it's small so this is something else that you can carry along with you um, and it's just a matte finish like 
So I'm not really sure. This probably will work great for me. Small bottle. I think this is like two or three bucks. I'm not really sure. But this is by the brand RK by Kiss. It's by Kiss. I, you know what? I really need to get my glasses because I can't see. But this is by the brand Kiss, so we all know who Kiss is. So I'm pretty sure this is going to work really great because Kiss has some good stuff. Check out Style 21. They have like loads of makeup and stuff like that that is really inexpensive. You can also get tools for your hair and makeup and things like that on their website. I love websites that have a little bit of everything and different prices. You know what I'm saying? Especially for those who love makeup and don't want to be like all oh, like what well, I just want to spend money on it because I don't really like spending a lot but for sure I would definitely spend a little bit just so that way I can have like a nice little collection it never hurts to try different things so I love you guys stay deep and delicious make sure you rate comment subscribe I will post all the information below for style 21 and on that note I will see you guys in a soon to come video